Hey everyone, John from Ride Upstate, and today I want to talk about a new delivery option that was made available to me in the Uber app, and that is Uber Direct. Now, I was really surprised to see this. This is basically going beyond food delivery, and you could be delivering documents, small auto parts, packages, and things like that. Let me read the description to you and I'll tell you why I chose to sign up for this. So here we go, right from the app, introducing Uber Direct, a new earnings opportunity. You can now deliver items from participating organizations in your area with Uber. What to expect from Uber Direct? Items may be as large as a large suitcase. Items may be as heavy as 50 pounds per package. Items may include a variety of items, such as documents, equipment, small auto parts, or household items. If you receive a delivery request, the offer card will say delivery package at the top of the card. Once the delivery is accepted, you will receive relevant package information on the order information screen beneath any notes from the requesting organization. You may cancel a delivery request for any reason, including an item that you may not be able to lift or that may not fit in your vehicle. If you would like additional details on the items, please contact the requesting organization. All right, so I signed up for this, despite the fact that normally when I do deliveries, they're in the evenings and I don't really do anything on weekdays. I'm going to give this a try every once in a while and maybe go out for an hour at lunch on my lunch break and see if I can do some of these package deliveries. This is very interesting to me and there's a couple of reasons that I decided to do this. Well, the first one obviously is that it's just more options and more ways to make a little bit of extra money. This is a side hustle for me and having that extra option to do say alcohol, which I've signed up for as well, and to do these item deliveries is great. Uh, it just kind of widens the pool of availability for me as a, someone who is not taking passengers right now. The second reason is any opportunity that I have to not have a food or drink spill in my car, because no matter how careful you are, something is going to spill or leak in your vehicle. Now, it may not necessarily get on your seats or it may not even leak out of your delivery bag, but it still has the potential to make a mess and cause a problem. In addition to that, I don't have to worry about things smelling up my car. And the third reason is, although I could probably do package delivery for Amazon, I don't really want another app to have to manage and learn. And being able to do this um, quite easily, all in one app is really nice. One of the things that really bugs me about some of the other delivery apps is they are not all inclusive. For example, DoorDash, when you get a food delivery, you're getting text messages. When you have to communicate, you can't communicate with the customer inside the app. There's no navigation inside the app. I like the fact that everything is contained inside the Uber app. Does it make it a little bloated? Yes. Can it be a little buggy sometimes? For sure. However, being able to do everything in one app and not leave the app is the best way. And if I can do different types of deliveries and not have to switch apps, that's even better. I'd like to hear from you. Are you doing Uber Direct? Have you done any package deliveries for Uber Direct? What's that been like for you? Please share it in the comments below. My name is John from Ride Up State, and remember, just because you're in a small market doesn't mean you need to settle for small profits.